Hello everyone, this is Valhalla Gaming TV and this is the channel that plays everything so you don't have to. We are back again with Crime Scene Cleaner Part 7. Alright, let's get back into it. Putting that shelf together. Oh my god. You gotta put the nails in the wall, man. How was that even hanging up? There's not even a hole in the wall. Did I put it back up there? Man, he didn't even put the nails in the actual board underneath. He missed all of them. What? Yeah, he needs to stick with cleaning. That noise. Hey, Daddy Dexter. is a criminal now, but you're still a good boy. Yeah. Look at the eyelashes on him. I just noticed that. Holy crap. That mode trucker's an alien. All right, we got a phone going. my phone. There it is. Morning, Kowalski. This time I have an easy peasy job for you. You need to clean up the dead rat, Tyler. One small apartment, just a few bodies. Go to his place, tidy it up, and that's it. That fool and his normal girlfriend hosted a conspiracy meeting against me. Now at least I'm done for good with this nomad shit. For fuck's sake, Tyler. You of all people should have known that this guy wouldn't let it pass. What an idiot. He didn't seem very smart in the first place. Go see what we got down here. Okay. Rat problem. Let's do this one. Tyler Novak, Tyler the businessman. What's up, Mr. No or Kowalski? You see, lately I've been thinking a lot about the future. That's kind of crazy, because it all started getting better ever since you saved my ass from that Rob situation. People in the gang really respect me now, and I feel as if my whole life made a quick 180. I have lots and lots of plans. I even think of creating my own business in the future. Find yourself some free time and I will tell you the details in person. Jim might be a little crazy, but he's a damn good, he's damn good to his loyal people, and I'm the most loyal. The best gangsta ever. He also speaks highly of you, so I guess we might be kind of on the same page. But just in case, let me know if there's anything I can do to help you. Man, this guy is dumb. Got himself killed. Five bodies. It turns out that some nomad leftovers tried to make it their last will to get their revenge against me. Pathetic bastards. Anyway, I got them first, as I always do. That stupid rat Tyler was trying to impress some ex-nomad bitch and sold me out. He even invited these guys over for a secret meeting in order to join their scheme and screw me. Once I found out, I sent my people to spoil their fun. Now they are finally done for good, Jim. Alright, let's accept the mission. Friendly fire. Man. So we got involved with that lady. Which I think was a prostitute at some point. And then she basically talked him into doing stuff. Kind of reminds me of Breaking Bad. Uh, when Jesse was trying to, uh, he got with that girl, and then she was trying to get money. If you guys haven't seen that. Uh, Big Jim claims that Tyler was going to sell him out to the nomads, but it's really, is that really the whole story? I guess we'll find out. It's gonna be a long night. Say the word. Uh, it'll be a long night. That's right. Sometimes I wonder if it all had to end up like this. Tyler was a grown man making his own decisions. There was nothing more I could do to save him. But was that death truly necessary? You know, like gang violence and all that stuff, I think it probably was. Oh man. Place got messed up. Finally got his own. Oh, you don't have to go all out. Here I am. Well, we don't have to go way out of here now. So we, all this stuff's right there. I like that. Look around. We got someone here. That's not him. Got some evidence. And how about you, dude? I don't know. I'm kind of working out my life right now. What do you mean? I found a new job. Normal job. Time to move on. You, normal job? Yeah, right. It looks like they were trying to get their lives together. Well, they had a place and stuff. I think they just got greedy. Rubber ducky. Is Sudoku back to its former glory? 
Interesting. Look around some more. So we got one body in there. Let's just grab the body real quick. It's time to leave. The movie night is over. Get in there. Oh, the kitchen. Oh, they got a pizza in and everything. Oh my goodness. Somebody got blasted. It wasn't the best time for snacks. Get in there. Got him. I like how the bodies just get like sucked away. Looks like normal party supplies. Five chips, three popcorns, one thing of butter, frozen pizza, three of them, one salt. What is that? Salted sticks? It's probably like pretzels. Five ice creams, one waffle, and hummus for Carla, and infinity beer. <laughs> Beer Infinity. Oh. Fifty. The end. Oh, there's a bullet casing. Yep. Three of them. Okay, we got two bodies. See where the other ones are. Oh, it looks like he's got like a... Is that like a green screen? Something. Oh, it's just a back... A backdrop for his uh, computer stuff, it looked like. Open these up. Uh, why is there a little teepee over here? Day 17 of Sudoku therapy. So, yeah, I'm solving Sudokus again. I'm kind of starting to get how it works. My therapist told me that it's good for my mind, but this shit is hard. Like, what number am I supposed to type in here? God, you better be right, Doc, because I am freaking stretching my mind here but I think I actually feel slightly better Sudoku therapy maybe you should have thought about getting a second opinion on that yeah that's pretty weird I've never heard that before oh yeah money time give me all that money oh excuse me good chair Okay. Must be all the Sudoku that he's been doing. How do you say that? Sudoku or Sudoku? Not good therapy for me. Amateurs. I'll call it Sudoku. Right. Got a picture? Sorry, Paul. This was out of my control. I hope at least you're reunited with your son now. Ah, uh, okay. Tyler got us into it. Oh, this is a uh, girl. Nowhere to run, nowhere to hide. Must be the lady. Always getting wrapped up in the bad things, man. Letting people get in your head. Yeah, uh, who's this? Is that him? Sorry, Tyler. Yep. This isn't the kind of trouble I can get you out of. Dang, he got messed up in there. Oh, there's cat paws. All right, get in there. You messed up, Tyler. Who knows if I won't end up like that one day. What's in here? Please don't touch anything. I'm tired of constantly changing strings and we need to save. Love you, Trisha. Tyler seems to have liked music, but I guess music didn't like him back. Or is this the lady? I invited my pals. There will be five of us. I'm not sure about them. Won't they try to pull some shit? Come on, these are my friends. I know, sweetie, it's just... No, yeah, you are right. It'll be fun. I think you're gonna actually like them. Just try to get along, all right? Okay, it'll be fine. It did not go fine. Yep. Must be here. You must be Trisha. Tyler talked a lot about you. He messed up. Got it with the wrong crowd. I wish we had met under different circumstances. Okay. Ooh, got some money in here? Uh, drugs, I mean. Same thing. Just a different currency, really. 
Got a ring. Is set. What is that, Garnacho? Must be playing guitar. Interesting. All right, anything of value here? Okay, right, we got all the bodies. I'm about to pull out them scrub daddies in a second. All right, this door is open. What's this? Oh. Well, that sucks. I guess I'm carrying, uh. Yeah, I guess I am cleaning up more than five bodies. That's messed up. Right? Anything else? Let's carry, uh, let's start with the trash. Good okay, start. Get all the trash up. go and I love it when it's right here super easy oh didn't get this dear mr. Novak regarding your recent application we must we have just found a perfect flat for you and your lovely girlfriend it was a big kitchen or has a big kitchen one bathroom two rooms and a balcony and is located in a quiet residential area with good transport links and shops all around I will be glad to give you a tour before the possible signing of a real estate purchase agreement it's all within the discussed budget homeland uh, Homeline Advisor Group. You really were trying to get your shit together, weren't you, Tyler? Yeah, but it didn't work out. Oh, I gotta break this. Let's grab out the old axe. That'll do it. Is that broken up enough? And I think it is now. Okay. Whenever there's a fist, not broken enough. All the trash. And if we're gonna use the scrub daddy, we don't gotta worry about it. You know what I'm saying? It doesn't. We're not gonna make new trash. Let's just clean it all up. Now all the trash. Gotta get the bullet casings. Broken bottles everywhere. Oh, more bullet casings. Can't forget those. That is kind of evidence, you know. Looks like it won't let me pick that one. Oh, already didn't. Okay. It lied. Didn't look like it was highlighted. I think we're gonna be making a lot of trash bags. Oh, we gotta break that one. Grab as much as we can before I go do that. There we go. Now we're full. Let's go break that piece over here. I might have to break that over there too. Is that all good? No fist. Okay. That looks like it's good. Pull out the trash. Nope, that's the scrub daddies. We need the trash bags. Alright. Making progress on the trash. Look how many bags we got already. Bags add up quick. Broken laptop. Could have left the electronics out of it, man. What did they do? Excuse me, good chair. Trying to pick up some trash. Thank you. That chair doesn't get out of my way. It's going to be trash. Ooh, there's money on the floor. I didn't even notice all that. Give me the Benjamins. Any trash in here? I guess that's trash, but it doesn't really matter. Not like I'm supposed to be in here trying to clean up the mess. <laughs> At least not their trash. The evidence is what we need to get rid of. Alright. We got some in here, and I think we're good. Get all the bullet casings. 
Here we go. He spared no bullet. It says 98% of the trash has been picked up. Where's the other trash? Ooh, what's this? Money. Okay, I'm missing trash somewhere. Arrow, where can the trash be? Oh, looks like the cat ran out the window. Oh, there's drugs hidden back here. Anything else? There's got to be trash somewhere in here. That's 98%. Oh, there we go. On the bed. Oh, and I'm full, really. <laughs> On the last piece. You can just pick that one up with your hand. Okay, I think that's it. There we go. We got it. Okay, let's get that scrub daddy and start cleaning. We're gonna have to get this furniture up. And that poor, uh, I don't know what it is, a dog or a cat. It might be a dog because it's got that bed over there. It was in the middle of all this, though. Seems to have gotten away. That means he left a witness, man. There we go. That's clean. Cleaning all the furniture first. So I can place it where it needs to be. What else we got? I think those are clean. Oh, this one needs to be cleaned. There we go. Oh, darts. Okay. Let's get this table. And this chair I know is dirty. Get the furniture here real quick, the couch, and then I'll get that chair flipped over. And that... It must have been a cat. Got it. They ain't completely clean yet. There it goes. Clean up the bed. Is this bed on pallets? It is on pallets. <laughs> a pallet bed. Interesting box spring. That one's good. Furniture is getting cleaned up. We're making progress. I don't know if that needs to be cleaned or not. Doesn't look like it. Okay. Anything else in here that needs to be cleaned? Ah. Cool. About this one that one looks good ah there we go definitely this okay yep missed the rest of that okay I think me might be okay to put the rest of this place together after we clean this That's a, it's got to be a cat. It's jumping all over the place. Okay, it looks like that goes there. Oh, there we go. I think that might be it. Oh, we got something here. Oh, and that chair in there I didn't flip over. Oh, it got flipped over on its own. As good as new. Well, I probably pushed it on accident. But it works. Oh yeah, we're about uh, to the point I'm needing to clean up the scrub, Daddy. I have to go get some water. Yep, it's coming up. 
Just waiting for it. All right, let's start putting some furniture back. This goes here. Where's this chair going? Okay. Got a gaming chair, but it looks like it's going there. Must be in here that this needs to go. There's two gaming chairs. Okay, let's put the monitor up here. Where'd the other one go? There it is. Easy rubber ducky. Get the furniture in place. Gotta be flips? Yeah. It is looking better. Like nothing ever happened. I take it we're gonna have to move this over here probably. Just close that window real quick. Where's the other cushions? There's some. We need one more after this one. Those two go over there. Guessing this goes here. Where'd that last cushion go? Did it end up in the kitchen or something? I have no idea. Hiding somewhere. Behind the couch? Okay, let's put this over here. There we go. And yeah, we're missing that cushion. That cushion? That cushion for sure. Right? Got another speaker over here. Oh, this needs to be cleaned up. There we go. Interesting setup. Okay. Gotta get the old bong. Can't forget that. Ooh, something is still over here. Money. Lots of money. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with that, you know? He's not gonna need it. Oh, cushion. Probably walked by that a few times. No on my luck. Oop. Okay. 25 out of 36 furniture. I guess we're going in this room. Okay. What else needs to be moved around? We got this one. Put the drawers back in. There. No one will even notice. Ah. Nailed it. Uh, looks like this needs to be moved here. This, uh... Tool. Okay. Almost done with the furniture. A few more things. You go there. Turn you around. There we go. Got a keg. I guess we'll just close the pizza in there and just leave that be. We got two more things. Ooh. Okay, the keg goes over here. I gotta wash it, though. Quit rotating, man. And now there's one more thing that needs to be redone. Oh, I saw that back there. Thank you. Anything missing in here? Maybe it's in this room. No. Something back here. What are we missing? Nothing on the shelves over there. Oh, 
Okay, there we go. Yeah, we got it all. Okay, let's get to cleaning then. We'll start in the bathroom. That's where we're gonna get the bucket. Get our detergents going. Detergents. Increase resistance, slow down rate, increase ability. We want to get the size of it. Washing surface. Did I ever... Oh, we can put two. Yeah, okay, I got that upgrade. Uh, increase tool resistance by 20% in cleaning area. By, ooh. Yeah. Ooh, this is going to be crazy. Okay, let's not knock it over now. Put it right over here. This should be crazy now. Get all the little paw prints. Sponges have been upgraded. Oh yeah, this is cleaning up pretty good. Look at that. This blood has no chance. Quite a bit, though. These sponges are getting filled up quick. Little spots here. Bathroom might be done. Oop. Didn't see the ring there. There we go. Okay, let's start in the uh, kitchen, then. Get this kitchen all cleaned up. Yeah, there's so much. Making the progress. These scrub daddies are awesome. I keep saying it, but I just think they're way better because it doesn't knock anything over. You don't got to worry about cleaning up. Like, you, you take the blood out, and you don't got to worry about breaking more stuff and making more of a mess. It just does the job. It even gets the hard to get stains too. Oh, they're filling up. Although that mop upgrade that I saw before where we can actually have where you only got to use the bucket, that does sound pretty cool. Might have to try that upgrade. Anything else in here? Yep, got it right over here. Of course. That's in the way. That might be a little bit of a problem when I'm cleaning out. I have to move some furniture. No, no, no. We don't want to use that. All right. Put the furniture back. Bring out the script, Daddy. Is that everything in here? Anything else? I think we're good in here. Although I never checked the drawers. Oh, we got some peppers. Any money? Got cans. Oop. There we go. Okay, cereal, table salt. We got that coffee blend. It's a pretty nice house. Like a little apartment or something. I'd be happy with this. Okay. We did get all the evidence. We just search for all that. We're good. Okay. Pull out the sponges. As I put them away. Get rid of all the paw prints. From the clearly scared cat. That would be pretty scary. Freaking gunfire and bullets going off. Cat doesn't know what's going on. Okay, I think this one's done. That little spot right there. And we'll work on this room. I like the like systematic approach where you go from like one room to another. Make sure it's nice and clean. Work our way around. Cleaning up a crime scene in a video game is kind of therapeutic. I don't know about in real life. Probably won't be very fun. Some people really like to do that stuff, though. I feel like that'd have to be like a calling. Kind of like being a mortician. I couldn't do any of those jobs. 
That would be rough. But we definitely need those people. Okay, let's get these paw prints. Oh, missed a spot there. Looks like we can clean under this one. Kinda. I was able to reach it. We're good. Only gotta move the big one. Okay, let's go get that water bucket. Alright, be nice and easy now. Careful. Ooh. Keep it high. And let's put it right here. Hopefully that's out of the way and I don't hit it. All right. I don't know, should I clean this up? I guess I can. Don't really wanna make it look like someone just, you know, left in a hurry. I wanna make it look like it's planned out, you know, like take some clothes out of the closet, maybe the luggage, make it look like they went on a trip. That's the way to do it. Went on a trip and never came back. Only thing that they wouldn't know is the destination, you know? Because technically, I guess they did go on a trip. A trip to the next life. Yeah, these scrub daddies are cleaning this up so quick. We got like one and a half rooms left after this. Is that it? Oh, we got the wall here, or that door. Just think of the money, think of the money. Think of all the money. Okay, looks like this room's good. Grab the bucket. I think I'm gonna put this right in the corner here. I shouldn't hit it here. I keep saying that, but I'm totally expecting myself to like run into it at some point. I can't trust myself with a bucket. They should have like a weight on it or something. So or lock much blood. It. I'm seeing red now. They should put a, an upgrade so you can lock the bucket so you can't knock it over. Or like a finesse upgrade or something where you can walk through it. That would be specifically for people like me. That would be the way to do it. Kind of like how you can walk through the blood and it doesn't leave footprints. Oh, clean up the paint. Cleans up that paint like it wasn't even there. Okay, is that all of it? We got some more over here. Might be able to clean this whole house with one bucket of water. Okay, maybe not. Let's see. Nope. That's it. And yeah, I'm definitely not going to be able to clean all that up. So, one and a half buckets. Let's go with that. Feel pretty good. Especially with all the detergent that I can use now. Okay. Anything else? Around a little bit more. Yes, spot. Anything on the curtains? Okay, I think it's just this room now. Oh, there's so much in here. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna, yep, need a bucket. Come here, Mr. Bucket. We almost made it. You were almost able to handle it all. So proud of you. You don't need no detergent for this one. Just get it clean. Almost done anyways. I guess that area one did have a good effect on it though. Yeah, there's so much blood on this. 
Ooh, look at that. Lean. Take a look around real quick. Make sure I didn't miss anything. I close that? Yeah, close it. Okay. I think we're good. Let's go empty this. And let's get out of here. I'm gonna miss a secret watch. All right, let's head out. All right, 100%, I know I got that. Did it in 31 minutes, that was pretty quick. It wasn't huge. Yep, there's a 100% score. Perfect. Complete. Okay. Money gain, 12,000. Come on, don't miss them. Oh, look at all those skill points. Eight of them. Okay, we got... Oh, I missed two secrets? I didn't even find any of them, apparently. Ooh, I got an achievement for uh, completing a mission without breaking any items. Oh, nice. Thank you to the scrub daddies. Find my phone. Hello? Outstanding job, Kowalski. This red Tyler tried to get to me, but I can smell trails for miles. Good thing you, Mr. Kowalski, are not like them. Big You're Jim's right. becoming even more unhinged with each day. I just really hope he doesn't get any wrong ideas, so I won't be next on his list. Make sure you do your job. You'll be good to go. Okay. Oh, is he repainting this? Yeah, it looks like he's repainting the room. The paint job in here's not bad, actually. That shelf he didn't put up, but that one's fine. I don't know how he messed up that other shelf so hard. Okay. Oop, let's look at the skill tree real quick. And we got the mops. Cleaning, increase the speed of mops and sponges. And let's look through these real quick. Pressure washer, not interested at the moment. Increase the bag capacity by 20%. I think I might want that. I got eight points. So that's four. And then there's three, four, five. Uh, yeah, so that's seven. So I could afford all that. You can pour three detergents in the bucket. Ooh. Yeah, that might be awesome. General... Yeah, we already got all that. So the garbage collection would be nice. But so would this. You can carry an additional sponge. Okay. Mop and sponge can no longer leave blood stains. I don't really need that, though. I kind of got that down. Yeah, I'm just... Let's go with this one. Increase this speed. That's two. Tools. Let's go with that. And we got one extra. Pressure washer, cleaning. I don't really want to carry an additional sponge, I guess, but we don't need to upgrade that. I might just save some points. Pressure washer, tank capacity. I'll just go with that. We'll increase the tank capacity of the pressure washer. Okay. All right, everyone, that's the end of this episode. I'll see you in the next one. Hey everyone, you made it to the end of the video. Thanks for watching. On the bottom of the screen, if you like, comment, share, subscribe, you can support the channel. Also, check out the videos above. That'll take you to more content from Valhalla Gaming TV. Thanks again. Later.